Hey, this is Patrick from Frontly. I'm really excited to share our improved AI generation feature, which allows you to build custom apps that generates AI responses with multiple distinct fields. As you can see here, I've got my AI movie generator app, and it's gonna generate just from a plot summary that I type in, it's going to give all of these fields back. So let's just try it out in real time. I've got a plot here. Um, a child discovers he has special powers and tries to hide them. So I'm gonna click generate movie and behind the scenes, AI is going to respond with all of this stuff. Okay, so here we go. We've got a name, protagonist, rising action, climax, all these things. And what's really great is that this is being logged into my Google Sheet. So you can see it's already here with a couple other ones that I've done. And so let's just try um, something totally different. Um, you know, two sisters take a road trip to see their favorite band and face challenges along the way. So we're gonna get a totally different response every single time. Um, even if we did the same prompt again, we would get a different, you know, subtly different response. And so now let me jump in to show you a little bit about how this was set up. This is just an overview, but we do have a full length 23 minute step-by-step -step app build video for this same app and you can, you can try it out. So um, we have a form and we have a submit action that triggers an open AI request. And you can see here the prompt is very simple. Generate a movie idea based on the following summary. And then I'm passing in the form dot plot summary variable, which accesses the data input into the plot summary field. And then I have my response type set to object. So instead of just a plain text response, we're getting an object, which basically just allows us to define all of these different uh, keys and descriptions, which tell the AI to respond with all of these fields. And I've written my own plain text descriptions for the AI just to give it some context. So this is really powerful because you can do a lot more with this than you can with a plain text response. And we even have the ability to add training examples where you get to, um, for each, as many as you want, you get to see all of your custom fields here. You can provide examples. So the AI knows if you give this prompt, here's an example of the way it should respond. This would drastically increase the reliability of the response. And so then I'm just logging the response in my Google Sheet and then I'm setting it to the local state using the action steps variable and grabbing all the fields that I've defined. So it's actually pretty simple in this case and then I'm using a rich text block to display all the responses here uh, from the local state. So uh, if you're interested in building this yourself, you can follow our full tutorial and you can build your own and then you can modify it for whatever purpose you want. Thanks for watching.